about our friends at Microsoft. <laughs> Windows 95, folks, is designed in the program to create an audit report of your hardware and software, everything in your computer. If you register online via the Microsoft Network or Microsoft's BBS, all of the details of your system, unbeknownst to you, will be uploaded to Microsoft. Talk about Big Brother. This is it. The original article that uh, blew this wide open appeared in Computer Reseller News over a year ago. Now, just in case you think that that was a fluke and they didn't really put it in there and Cooper's full of it, well, folks, it's not a fluke. And as usual, I'm certainly not full of it. Although sometimes I wish I were because it mean, would mean we didn't have to pay any attention to all this crap. But unfortunately, it's true. Now, there it was a column called In Short in Information Week on page 88. This is Information Week magazine, May 22nd, 1995, right before the release. The column is called In Short, page 88, Information Week, May 22nd, 1995. Microsoft officials confirm that beta versions of Windows 95 include a small viral routine called Registration Wizard. <laughs> Wizard. It interrogates every system on a network gathering intelligence on what software is being run on which machine. It then creates a complete listing of both Microsoft's and competitors' products by machine which it reports to Microsoft when customers sign up for Microsoft's network services. Due for launch later this year, customers must actively disable the routine if they don't want it to run. Now, if you're not a programmer, forget it. You would never know how to disable this routine. The implications of this action and the attitude of Microsoft to plan such an action beggars the imagination. And it may be just a very small implication of what is to come. Hmm. Now, folks, the way to get around it is don't use Microsoft Network. Don't register online with Microsoft. And don't ever call Microsoft's bulletin board. It's as simple as that. Or you can find yourself a programmer that knows how to disable this thing. You see, what's so dangerous about this, folks, is is uh, a fellow got hold of the beta test CD of Win95, and he set up a packet sniffer between his serial port and the modem. So when you try out the free demo time on the Microsoft network, it transmits your entire directory structure in the background. That's what he found. This means that they have a list of every directory and potentially every file on your machine. Your financial records. The set of books that you use to keep track of your business. Oh, yeah. All of your friends and relatives, their addresses and telephone numbers. Your newsletter mailing list of all the people you promised you would never give out their name and address. <laughs> it would not be difficult to have something like a file request from your system to theirs without you even knowing about it. This way they can get a hold of any juicy routines or files or papers or letters you've written, your books, and I don't mean books that you read, I mean your financial records, and claim them as their own if you don't have them copyrighted. <laughs> How about that? See, Big Brother is not an invention. Big Brother 